Hello YouTubers and welcome to Dave on the Webs channel. So I thought I would bring you an unboxing and quick overview of this self picture monopod, so a selfie stick. Um, you may have seen this in one of my haul videos um, and I just thought I'd like I said share it with you guys um, just to show you what comes in the box. And like I said, a very quick overview of the product itself. So let's get straight into this. And for the first time as I open this, so I can see myself what I've actually bought. Okay, so there we go, box off. Just put that into the back. Okay, we can see it's all in this plastic tray, so quite well packaged. And we can see there the selfie stick itself at the top. Um, we have a wrist strap. We have a uh, remote control, uh, which is really, really handy. It's a separate remote control, not obviously in the stick. Um, we have the mount for a phone. Um, I've got an iPhone 6, so that should fit in there. Let's put that down. We have... This is going to be for um, camera, I'm assuming. And take that off the end there. Looks like that's going to be some sort of camera mount, although it looks like it can go into the bottom of there as well. So just testing this out as I get these bits out. We have that there, which looks to me like it's for a GoPro. Just bring that in so you can see that there. So let's just get the remote control out. There we go, there is the remote control. Nice little handy tag there, so you could put it on a key ring or something. On off switch there on the side. And we've got camera. It says camera 360 iOS. What's that one there? Can't quite see what that is, but anyway, gonna be your uh, camera buttons. Like I said, there is the wrist strap. We have Ah, battery. Um, so battery there, which I'm assuming is going to be for the remote control. Um, and then obviously we're going to have the selfie stick itself. And before I get the selfie stick, we have user manual. So that's cool. We do have a user manual um, there that comes in with it. Uh, we'll take a little look at that. A little bit later, but anyway, so the stick itself, and um, we can see well, we can see there at the very end is going to be the mount um, to fix the camera to. And um, we have there so that we can adjust the mount that way, like so. It seems to be a screw then. It's probably going to be here yeah, to tighten that up. Um, obviously, it is extendable. Feels really good, I have to say. It does feel very sturdy. That certainly feels metal to me. Um, we then obviously have our release clips here so we can extend it. So, if we take that one out, you can see there, extending, and we can take the other one out and just extend that one right out. And again, the final one, and that is actually, if I can. Uh, Try and get this all in the shot. You can see there, very long. That is actually a very long selfie stick when it's out there. So that is pretty good actually. So if you want some real, I guess, distance shots from yourself, um, excellent. And again, obviously we can bring that back in and clip it back into place. Really nice and solid. And the final one, bring that back into place. And of course, you know, you don't have to bring it all the way in. You can get it to pretty much whatever distance you want to so it doesn't have to go all the way out halfway clip and that's solid in there then pull that back in we also have a mount down the bottom here so at this stage i'm just going to have a quick look at these um, instructions so we've got connect the phone adapter to the top so let's just put the phone adapter on it. There we go, that's that fitted on. 
two. Remember to fix the rotary knob so you can easily screw in the adapter. Okay, and yeah, that's done. I guess this is so that we can uh, angle it properly. But okay, uh, three. The length could be adjusted. Yeah, unscrew to adjust the head degree. Okay, so that does that one. This is then for the other mounts. Unscrew front adapter screw in the GoPro. So obviously, yeah, it's the GoPro adapter. Uh, da -da -da -da. That's how to open it. What's this one? GoPro mount screw and screw cap. Uh, so that's for GoPro by the looks of it. But anyway, I haven't got a GoPro myself, so can't entirely say. Um, and then we've got the uh, tripod screw hole. Okay, cool. So down the bottom there tripod screw hole in the bottom um, and then we've got the remote shutter um, as well obviously put the battery in it etc so I'm just going to uh, stop the video I'm actually going to go and get my phone that I actually can't oh, I have I will say it's in my pocket how oh, silly of me so there's my iPhone um, 6 plus so I'm just going to try get this slotted in here hopefully this does fit this is where it turns into disaster and i find out it doesn't fit my phone but yeah there we go fits perfectly i have to say um, and that's with a case on the phone okay so if i was to do that for example let's get those bits out of the way tighten that up okay i'm just going to switch it on Try to get my fingerprint to be recognised. For some reason, it's not liking my left one at the moment, and it's not liking my right one either. There we go. Um, camera on. Okay, there we can see that way. Um, and now, if I switch the camera, you're going to get to see me. There we go. And obviously, the camera that I am recording this with. But um, so yeah, there we go. So let's just extend this back out like so and there you go you get to see me being recorded by me over here um, but yeah you know, that just looks pretty good need to give it a bit of a test obviously um, test it out better um, but yeah first impressions that looks pretty good is wobbling around a little bit there but that's only because I haven't entirely tightened that up um, but when you do there you go nice and solid let's take that out um, one of the things I wanted this for as well was so that I could fit my camera on it and obviously that's going to be achievable because we do have the mount there to put the camera on but my camera's kind of recording this but anyway so unboxing very quick overview stroke review of that product i have to say does does seem pretty good obviously i haven't tested it yet you've seen this live with me uh, my name's dave thanks very much for watching and i look forward to seeing you all in the next video cheers bye for now